The City of Refuge, it's a community within a community designed to welcome individuals and families in whatever stage of life they may be. With a focus on community, the City of Refuge Foundation is organized exclusively for charitable purposes in accordance with Section 501c3 of the Internal Revenue Service. The mission of the City of Refuge is to create a Christ-centered community of caring that ministers to the spiritual, physical, educational, emotional, or rehabilitative needs of individuals and families. The City of Refuge is located on 33 acres of land on Winstead Avenue in Rocky Mountain, North Carolina. In 2006, a vision to develop the property for members of our community who were often overlooked and underserved was cast. The City of Refuge began its journey by renovating the Johnson home to serve as a place of refuge for international missionaries who were on furlough. The home also serves as a temporary residence for missionary families who have completed training and are awaiting clearance to begin their service on foreign soil. The Harvest Home is a welcome environment for missionary families who have answered the call to share the gospel to the ends of the earth. An inclusive park will provide a place of refuge for families in the community. Families will come to this place of refuge and enjoy all that the park offers. The first phase of the park has begun with a walking trail through the natural areas offered on the property. Small streams, bamboo areas, river birches, all bring a sense of God's creation and serenity to our busy lives. Exiting the natural area, one will continue on a walking path that encircles the entire property. Some might ask, why a playground? There are many families in our community and surrounding communities who have challenged children. The local school system reports that 14% of the student population is exceptionally challenged. Playgrounds may be plentiful, many are accessible, but they are not fully inclusive. Imagine a family with two children with one of those being challenged. One child gets to play on the park elements, the other sits on the table and watches. The City of Refuge Playground will encourage families to bring all their children, and most importantly, it will be designed to include all their children. A Miracle League baseball field will be a welcome addition to the City of Refuge. It will provide a place for children with different abilities to participate in activities that they are often left out of because they have special needs. Traditional sports leagues seek athletes with exceptional skills. The Miracle League of the Tar River region also seeks athletes with exceptional skills, just not merely in athletics, but in the reality of life. The Miracle Field will be a gathering point for people who have been overlooked and underserved. Hey, it'll be inclusive. Families and special athletes can come to a place where it doesn't matter if you run to first or third after you've hit a ball. It doesn't matter what the score is at the end of the game. And the only thing that matters is that you cross home plate, regardless of how long it takes. Imagine a child who's heard no most of their life when it comes to participating in a team sport but this morning, they get to put on a ball cap and a t-shirt that makes them part of a team. Their family will drive to the Miracle League of the Tar River region, located at the City of Refuge, and that child, for the first time, can hear a group of fans cheer and call their name. It'll be a place where miracles happen. But this vision only starts with the inclusive part. We envision a school that can profoundly impact future generations as we expand the kingdom of God, a hospice home that cares for patients and comforts their families, and a home for seniors that will provide a place of dignity for them to live out what is often referred to as their golden years, and a maternity home for unwed mothers, a transition home for those who are ready to re-enter the norms of society, and a Christian counseling center to assist people with struggling marriages or the general problems that come with life. All these opportunities serve as integral parts of a single ministry that, Christ, that is Christ-centered and reaches people where they are in life. In Matthew eleven twenty-eight, 28, Jesus said, Come to me, all who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. The City of Refuge will serve as a welcome place of rest for individuals and families, regardless of their age or ability. The City of Refuge is a God-sized vision. The City of Refuge is a long-term investment in our community. It's an investment that will minister to the underserved and overlooked in our city and surrounding counties. It will take community partners to make it a reality. So we invite you to join us as we begin building a foundation of Christ-centered community of caring that ministers to the spiritual, physical, 
educational, emotional, or rehabilitative needs of individuals and their families.